Hello everyone, in this tutorial I'll be showing you how to make video invitations on Canva. With Canva you'll be able to make video invitations for example for weddings or so on for completely free. All you'll need to do after you're signed up, I want you to tap right where you see the search bar and from there you're going to type in video invitation. After you have done that you can see different options right here. So if you want to create a wedding invitation video, you can do that. And also you can just select, for example, video invitations. After doing this, you will see numerous templates that you can choose from. As you can see right here, by scrolling down, you'll see numerous video templates that you can choose from. And by the way, anyone that you see with the pro right here, that means that you would have to be a paid subscriber on Canva to use that particular video template. But you can see there are a lot of templates that you can use for free. As you can simply scroll down and you can see the different templates. And for example, this is a nice wedding invitation. And you can also see a nice one right here. For this example, I'm going to choose this one. After you have selected the template that you would like to use, you are going to tap on customize this template. After selecting customize this template, you'll be redirected to a new page. And from here, we'll be able to edit our video invitation. As you can see right here, this is the canvas. And you can see that at the moment, the video is 14 seconds long. I will be showing you how to edit the amount of time. But the first thing I want you to do is pay attention to the timeline and currently how the video looks. So the first thing we are going to do more than likely, we are going to be changing the video. So you can change the video right here. All you'll have to do is tap on the video section. After you have tapped on the video section, from here let's say we want to add another image. So you can see how it looks at the moment. As you can see right there, this is currently the video. So let's say you want to add a video of you and your fiance. All you'll have to do, you could tap on uploads from the left hand menu option. And from there, you'll be able to upload a video. Or if you want, you could simply tap on elements. And from there, you could type in couple. So you could type in couple right there. Then after doing that, you'll select videos. Then you're going to see numerous couple videos that you can use. So all you have to do is scroll down until you see one of your liking, as you can see right here. And once you have found a video that you like, for example, this one right here, all you have to do is simply tap and drag it. So you'll drag it and place it right where the other video was, as you can see here. So now if I should tap on play, this will be, be the video, as you can see right there. And that's it. And also to change the name right here, all you have to do is tap on the text section. Then once you have highlighted the text, you can type in the name of the couple, for example. So you could type in the name of the couple. And you can also change the text style if you want. All you have to do is highlight the text then from here, you can tap right where you see Jimmy's script. Then you can select the font style that you would like to use. So let's say, for example, I want to use this font style. And you can also change the color of the text if you want, and also the size of the font. And by the way, you can edit the date. You can edit any one of the text option by simply tapping on the text box. And also, if you would like to change the background color, which is this right here, all you have to do is select the entire canvas. Then you are going to tap right where you see background color in the top left hand corner. And from there, you can select any other color. So let's say, for example, instead of black, I would like it to be a light gray. I could tap on light gray and you can see how it looks. And you can tap on blue and you could see it look right there. But let's say I want to use this color. You can see how it looks right there. And that's it. You can also change the color of the 
text as I said. So let's say I want to change the color of the text to black. I could tap on black. Also, if you'd like to edit the length of the video, you can. All you'll have to do is go to the end of the timeline. Then let's say, for example, you want the video to be shorter. As you can see at the moment, it is 17 seconds long. Let's say you want it to go down to 10 seconds. All you'll have to do is glide it to the left. And you can see right there, at the moment, it is 10 seconds long. Once you're finished editing your video, and also you can add an animation if you want. And if you're wondering what an animation is, let me simply go over to elements in the top left hand corner. Then let's say for example, I want a, a bird to be flying across or better yet a dove. So I'll type in dove, dove white right here. After I've done that, I would simply select this image of the dove as you can see right here. This one right here. All you'll have to do now for animation, let's say I pull it and place it right there and I minimize the size. Now to do an animation, all I'll have to do is tap on animation from the top menu option. After you have tapped on it, you're going to tap on create an animation. Then after I've tapped on create an animation, let's say I would want this to go to the top of the page. So I'll simply pull it to the top, then pull it back down, just for example sake. And you can see how it looks right there. And I'll steady it out so I can tap on steady. And you can see that it is now steady. Then I'll tap on done. And to see how this looks, all I have to do is go up to the top right hand corner and tap right where you see the time. And you can see how it looks right there. It looks good. And then all you have to do now, you'll go up and you'll tap on share in the top right hand corner. Then after selecting share, you're going to scroll down and you're going to tap on download. Then you'll tap on download right here to download the video. And that's it. Hope you found this video helpful and informative. If you did, be sure to hit the like button and subscribe.